What's going on, everybody? Welcome to another episode of Flight Simming with D at D Sims Corner on Facebook and YouTube. And today we are going to be doing a couple of uh, tourist flights on uh, NeoFly. Haven't uh, used this app in a while. It's a uh, NeoFly 4, the latest version uh, with uh, a lot of improved uh, U uh, UI, as you can see right there. Uh, it's a great little app for uh, GA flying. Um, you, you, you know, uh, he, he's developed it to the extent that available. you can run in uh, virtual airline and do airliners. But I like using this one for uh, GA flying and uh, a pilot's life for, you know, airliner work. So uh, great little app. Uh, you could I'll uh, put the link uh, in the description below so you can download it. Uh, there, there's a I think there's a freeware kind of demo type thing and then it's payware. But it's it's just a few bucks and the. You know, the, the immersion and uh, just the um, motivation to fly, um, you know, the purpose, as people like to say, to fly gives you a lot of that. Um, at some point, I'll just go over each piece of the uh, UI like I did with a pilot's life. But in this video, we're just going to do a couple tours here. We're going to fly over to Governor's Island and let folks, let some tourists take some pictures. And then we'll do another one where we go over uh, MetLife Stadium uh, in New Jersey. And we're here in Teterboro, which is in the game, uh, in, in NeoFly is, is my home base. And we're flying this Robin DR400, which I've never flown before. And it's a default plane. And uh, I already feel like it sucks. So we'll see how that goes. Now, of course, I am no expert in piloting or planes or anything of that nature, but this plane sucks. <laughs> it's like, it just, it's crazy. Like, I don't know if that's, if this is a characteristic of the plane, but, you know, any, just, just a little thrust and the plane just wants to go off to the side. Like, I'm, I'm like pulling, I'm like putting full thrutter, a pull, <laughs> thrutter, full rudder to keep the plane straight. That can't be right. Like, I understand, like, you know, when you're taking off with the single prop planes, you know, when you're adding thrust, you have to, you gotta, you gotta, you do have to hold to the rudder to keep the, but, I mean, this is ridiculous. But, of course, it's a default plane, I'm sure. I, I went in, I went to flight.to to see if there was any kind of, like, an, uh, a mod that enhances the plane, but, nah, it sucks. So, I'm gonna be finding the next chance to, uh get rid of this thing and get me a uh, at least to start off a, a Cessna a 152 or 172 oh this thing sucks but we're off it's we're gonna head over to Governor's day. Island and let these uh, touristies <laughs> take pictures and then we'll be back we're coming right back to Teterboro so let's see how we do I don't know what that view was <laughs> let's go I'm not a big fan of using the eye tracker in flight sim for some reason because it drives me crazy. It just kind of kind of makes me dizzy, and I'm sure in the video like it, it, it just makes like watching the video like the, the sudden movements and the constant movements. I'm not a fan of using it. Like I, I'll use I'll use the eye tracker for like American Truck Sim because it works better, but flight simming I, I just don't. I'm not a big fan of using the the eye tracker. I always shut it off. But for this one, I decided to be that it's kind of like an open windshield and, you know, it's a small plane. I figure I'd, I'd use the eye tracker for this. It's pretty cool. Uh, but I, I can see how this could easily get annoying with the head bobbing and the moving around. So uh, 
it just it, just, it does it just makes my eyes hurt <laughs> just uh, using the eye I'm, I'd rather move the camera with my mouse I mean it's not kind of realistic I guess or fluid but who cares I mean we all know it's a sim right <laughs> there's uh there's a uh, New York City Manhattan in the distance there we're gonna get over to Governor's Island which is a kind of like a it's in New York City I don't know if you've ever been there it's kind of like a, it's an island where they hold a lot of events it's, a, it's, it's kind of like a giant park uh, I mean there's some properties on there and I, I think there's a hotel but it's kind of like a uh, oh, look at that video of editing um, it's kind of like a a playground of sorts uh, on an island I hold a lot of concerts there I know there's a giant food truck festival that goes on on Governor's Island. Many, many events go down in, uh, on Governor's Island. So, It's right to the very southern point of Manhattan, Lower East Side. It's kind of nestled in between Brooklyn and, and Manhattan. There. So we're going to make our way over there and see if we can pass this little mission here. <laughs> in this DR400. I noticed this, I guess this is like a French plane or something because everything, like all the lights and descriptions and everything on the on the, in the cockpit is in French. So I have no idea what anything is. There's a Tower 1 there. Beautiful. Love it. Let's see if we can keep this plane on, up in the air, though. <laughs> Transporter, you are less than two nautical miles from the POI. Stay under 1,000 feet. Okay, turn around the POI as close as possible until they are done taking pictures.
Transporter from dispatch. Enough pictures for today. Good job. You can come back. <laughs> All right, man. Everybody, uh, everybody's done with their old school cannons, <laughs> shooting, <laughs> taking pictures. It sounded like the sound effect sounded like some kind of like 1950 newsroom <laughs> press conference <laughs> with the old school cameras going off. All right, man. So we're gonna head back to Teterboro. Uh, we're gonna fly up a little bit up the Hudson here in between uh, New York City and New Jersey. This is Jersey City right there off to the left. And uh, we're going to head right back to uh, the Teterboro and uh, drop these folks off. Hopefully they had a uh, great uh, sightseeing experience. <laughs> Don't forget to leave a tip at the little can I got back there. <laughs> All right, man, so we're going to head back and... Uh, and land this bird. See how it lands, man. Not a not a fan of this plane. Not a fan. Uh, I can't wait to get a a one five two. All right, with the beauty of editing, the runway is right in front of us, kind of. So uh, we're going to land this bird, and then we're going to go on another, uh, we'll go on another, uh, another tour, because, you know, we got to make this money, you know what I'm saying? I'm just trying to advance my career here. Also, I'm trying to get rid of this plane, <laughs> so we, we got to keep making that money. 
So we're going to land this burden right now, and, uh, and then we're going to jump right into uh, another mission. I don't know what she talking about, man. That, that landing was, wasn't too bad. But, uh, anyways, we're going to park, tell these people to get off. <laughs> we're throwing some new people in this, in this uh, French plane. Welcome back. You can let the snappers disembark the aircraft. Couldn't find valid airport data at this position. Services are not available. Miles all round. You must have given them some great angles for their photos. Hey, pilot. All right, man. So we're gonna pick another mission job. here, and again, in a later video, uh, if you haven't so seen it yet, I'm pretty sure there's a lot of tutorials out there right now and reviews about NeoFly. But just in the case, I'll, I'll do a little uh, review now. like I did, did with uh, a pilot's life. But we're gonna get a new uh, new mission here, which is to uh, we're gonna go fly around MetLife Stadium, which is in New Jersey. Uh, East Rutherford 
and we're going to take these folks to take some pictures above where the Jets and the Giants play. And we'll, we'll see what field is, uh, is, uh, is on there, uh, being that, you know, they both share the stadium, so it switches. Um, so we'll see. We'll see how that goes. <laughs> so let's get back up in the air. Look at that. The beauty of editing. And we're going to take off once again in this uh, tin can with wings. <laughs> And as always, man, once, uh, you know, while we're in the middle of uh, our departure here, I just want to thank those folks that uh, like the videos, man. They watch the videos, like the videos, hit like, throw comments on there. I appreciate it. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Uh, again, I'm not trying to be uh, a YouTuber or anything like that. I just, I'm just trying to document my progression in flight simming. Uh, it is a hobby that I've quickly come to trip. really it's love. And, uh, you know, uh, as you can see, I still need a lot of practice with uh, my landings, but we're going to get there, right, at some point. But, uh, yeah, it's just basically just a chronicle, uh, you know, my, my it, 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 you know what I'm saying, my journey and, and my improvement in flight me. So I appreciate all those that comment and, uh, and uh, you know what I'm saying, and hit like. We're almost at 100 subscribers. You're 89. Listen, that's big. That's a big number for me. I dig it. Appreciate y'all. I try to follow back as well, so. Let's make it over to East Rutherford. It's literally like right to the left. Like it's literally ne next door. So this one's going to be a quick one here. Transporter, you are less than two nautical miles from the POI. Stay under 1,000 feet. Okay, turn around the POI as close as possible until they are done taking pictures. All right, so they started uh, they started taking pictures early. <laughs> We're not even near yet. <laughs> They're over here clicking away. All right, well, whatever. <laughs> There's a uh, MetLife Stadium. Home of the uh, New York Giants, New York Jets. In New Jersey, East Rutherford, New Jersey. And they actually held the Super Bowl here, of all places. <laughs> let's see, let's see what let's see what they have. Oh, it's the Jets. They have the Jets laid out there. Alright. Interesting. That's pretty cool. Oh, well, that was that. They got their pictures, so it's time to uh, head back uh, to Teterboro, which uh, you can see right off to the left.
Oh, whoa, down. I just stalled at the very end. <laughs> Good thing I was close to the ground. The plane just flat out dropped. <laughs> she didn't say nothing about that though, right? Oh, that's funny. All right, man, we landed, man. There, there you go, a couple Neo missions. I'm trying to get rid of this plane and get me a 152 to start with. Uh, again, you have to build up, right? You got to make money and build up to better planes. Uh, so, you know, I'm going to try to get a 152. Uh, so in the next video, you will not be seeing me fly. If, if, the next Neo Fly video, you will not be seeing me using this, this contraption. <laughs> Anyways, thanks for watching, man. Again, leave comments, suggestions at the bottom. Greatly appreciate it. And I'll catch you on, uh, on the next video. Peace. Transporter, you can disembark the tourists. Couldn't find valid airport data at this position. Services are not available. Transporter, disembarking complete. I will call you when I have more tourists for you.